What's up everybody and welcome back to another video right here on the Crypto Grind channel. In this video, I'm going to be talking about Quant, the price right now, where I think it is going to go, and of course, what my price prediction would be in the future. So if that's something that interests you, make sure you're sticking around and watching all the way to the end of the video. And of course, if you're not already a subscriber, make sure you're hitting that subscribe button and hitting that bell notification so you know when another video goes live. Now, for everybody who is new to Quant and you've just heard about it, I'm going to give a basic rundown of what the project is. It's essentially a way that different blockchains connect together. That's the whole reason why Quant was created. So basically launched in 2018, the goal of connecting blockchains and networks on a global scale without reducing the efficiency and interoperability of the network. It's the first project to solve interoperability problems through the creation of blockchain operating system. Now they've called this blockchain operating system the overledger, and essentially it's a way that bridges the gap between existing um, blockchains throughout the, the, the crypto space, which I think is fantastic. Now I do think that interoperability is something that is gonna win outright in the next bull run. Along with utility, interoperability is going to be vital. And that's one of the reasons why I think Quant is such a special project. Along with the fact that they're also ISO 222 compliant. So they're going to be interacting with a lot of the financial institutions now and in the future. And we will touch on that a little bit as we go along and talk about that in this video. So having a look at the price, it is now under $100 at the time of recording. I don't know how long it's going to stay there. My feeling is we're going to be here or hereabouts for the next little while, possibly going back down to about $80, maybe a little bit lower, but I can't see it going much lower than about $70 at the absolute lowest. So it probably is a good time to be getting into the project DCAing in because Quant is absolutely going to explode one day, in my opinion. If we have a look now at the market cap, we're sitting at $1.2 billion, which is Pretty high, but remember there is still a lot of space to grow, considering that Quant went all the way up to nearly $400 at the height of the next bull run, so a market cap of about $5 billion. And we're really looking good in terms of circulating supplies or 80% out there. And also what is something that is very interesting that I wanted to point out is that there are only 14 million tokens. Putting that into perspective, that means 14 million people can only own one of these. So when these things do take off and financial institutions start making use of the crypto space and the blockchain a lot more. These are going to become very, very, very expensive tokens because they're going to be needed to be used on the quant space and the quant network as a whole. So really getting in now is, although it looks expensive at $100, it is still a bargain price. Many people do believe that this is going to hit four figures, possibly up to $4,000 in the next bull run. I can't say for certain that it's going to do that. I do definitely think it's going to go past the $400 mark. I would say at least double that to $800, possibly hitting $1,000. But a long-term play, I can see this eventually, and I'm talking now five to 10 years time from now, hitting about $8,000 per quant. So from this point on, you're looking at an insane, insane uh, multiple, you know, all the way 80x and so on. So it's really not impossible, but we're looking at 10 years in the future from now at that price point. For the next bull run, I would say anywhere from a 5 to a 10x is a comfortable prediction. So that's something that you could be looking at. And one of the higher cap projects that are solid if you're looking for good returns. Quant is probably one of the few for you. Moving on to the website for Quant. We, you do know that's one of the things that I do go through when we talk about these projects. Basically, the benefits of Quant, so if we have a look here, unlocking benefits for all, assets of all kinds from currencies to carbon credits are being tokenized on the blockchain, financial institutions, enterprises, and their customers all benefit from assets whose ownership is immutable um, and traceable, and the use is easier to manage. Entirely new digital economies are emerging as a result, and obviously one of the biggest projects and actually the first project to be released on the quant network is around the ownership of real world assets and that's one of the utilities and use cases and problems that they are trying to solve and that is the galileo protocol i have done a video on that so if you want to know more check out that video um, it's it's really a great project they tokenize real world assets and i do think that is a narrative that is going to absolutely explode in the next bull run as well so if we 
move on to some of the, the use cases that they have for this coin. You can see digital currencies. They are working with a few digital currency providers, the Digital Pound Foundation being one of them. Payment solutions as well, capital markets and supply chains. Now, supply chains is an interesting one because obviously they are going to be the, it is going to be the increased use of blockchain in these supply chains. And the way that you're going to be paying for this is either in fiat or in, in cryptocurrencies. And you're not always going to be on the same network. And that's exactly where Quant will be. Quant will be that middleman. Whether you are paying in Bitcoin or XRP, you are going to be able to facilitate payment between two people thanks to Quant. And that's exactly why they're positioning themselves so well. Obviously, they do have competition from Chainlink. I do think that there is space for both of these projects, but Quant is definitely going to have a lot more room to play with when it comes to price action. So that's exactly one of the reasons why I say Quant is definitely one to watch. Having a look at some of the projects that they have already worked with and some of the companies that they have, have already worked with, you'll see here that there are some big names. Obviously, Downing Street, that comes from the, the CBDCs when it comes to the Digital Pound Foundation, Deloitte, BP, HSBC, Visa, which is actually a pretty important one because you've got your payment gateways that are going between different places. So Visa, MasterCard are definitely going to be very important players in this area as well. So these are just a few of their biggest sort of projects that they have worked on. You can see that there are real use cases for it. And I definitely don't think that this is the end for quite. Now, if you also want a bit more of an understanding of where they fit into this whole ISO 222 area, this is one of the diagrams that I think best explains it. You've got Quant here in the middle with the overledger, which, as we spoke about earlier, is an operating system and the first of its kind in the crypto and blockchain space. And they are going to be facilitating payments across all areas. For example, you've got Ripple working with a lot of countries around the world for their CBDCs. If you are sitting in one of those countries and you want to pay, you know, facilitate a payment across to another country, that doesn't necessarily use the, the XRP ledger. For example, we know Italy are working with Algorand on their CBDC. Quant will facilitate that payment. You'll pay in Ripple and you will get your payment on the other side in Algorand, which is really positioning Quant in a pretty unique way and exactly why this coin is going to absolutely rocket when we see mass adoption in the future. And I just wanted to show you here as well the Digital Pound Foundation. If we have a look at some of their members and some of their partners, we just scroll across here and you will see, that's over here, sorry. If you have a look at some of their members over here, you'll see that we've got Ripple and we've also got Quant as some of their members, which there you go, Ripple and Quant. So they are working with the, the Digital Pound Foundation and that's not gonna be the end of it. They are working with other CBDCs. Now I know that not everybody likes CBDCs, but if you want to make money in crypto, sometimes you've got to follow the money. And this is exactly what following Ripple, following XRP, following Quant will get you. Moving on to their socials, 128,000 followers. So they've got a huge community and that's growing every day. They're very active. They have their, their um, different sea levels talking at different events all the time. This is one of the more recent ones as well, where they spoke about the, the Digital Pound Foundation and the British CBDCs. So that's something that you'd like to see. They do have everything on their page as well. Go check that out. And lastly then, just wanted to actually speak a little bit about my Patreon again. If it is something that you're interested in getting into, I do now have a seven day free trial. So if you're not too sure about which one is best for you, you now have a seven day free trial. Go ahead, check it out. If you're happy, obviously carry on. We'd love to have you as part of the community. I do think that there is a tier for everybody there, whether it's just getting these videos early or if you want to see my portfolios, get my selling alerts, staking alerts, my considerations, one-on-one -on -one time with myself as well. That's all there. So go ahead, check it out. Otherwise, make sure you're also joining the Telegram. It's free. We'd love to have you as part of the Crypto Grind community. I've got some other links down below for Tangem wallets. If you are looking for a hardware wallet that isn't Ledger, Tangem got a 10% discount for you there. And of course, also a link to MEXC. If you haven't traded there before, they do have some first time trader bonuses and discounts as well. So that's everything that I'm going to be talking about. Check out all the links down below. Let me know in the comments if you are holding Quant or if you think Quant is going to be huge, how big you think it's going to be. 
Thank you so, so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.